hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, man, peep game. I'm all for Floyd Mayweather, Oscar De La Hoya rematch. It makes a lot of sense. Uh, I think it would be very successful. I think if Floyd put together a solid undercard, it would do well over a million buys. Let's just face the fact, Floyd would be in sole control of a rematch with Oscar De La Hoya. It would be pretty much, you know, Mayweather promotions. And since Oscar got so much shit to say about Floyd Mayweather, he, that's what he should do. Get his ass back in the ring with Floyd. You know what I'm saying? Since you always got something to say. You know what I'm saying? Since you so fucking jealous of Floyd because that's what it come down to. You know what I'm saying? So what better way than to settle this than to get back in the ring? Now see, Oscar would be back into a wall also. Because if Floyd challenges him officially to a rematch and he says no, he would look like a straight punk. Because then, you know, people would say, well, why you called out Conor McGregor? And see, that's the thing. Oscar can dish it out, but he can't take it. You know what I'm saying? And then he tries to play victim. Oscar ain't in no position to be talking about Floyd Mayweather. And I'm going to tell you something. A lot of you motherfucking Oscar De La Hoya supporters ain't in no position to be talking about Floyd Mayweather and the woman beating shit with Oscar's past. This dude then got sued by women for allegedly attacking them and shit. You know what I'm saying? He settled a multi-million dollar you know, lawsuit with a 15 year old girl, not to mention his history with cocaine and, and you know, and alcohol, then the cross dressing shit. So, I mean, then not to mention, you know, the racist emails, then not to mention his racist comments he made towards black fighters, you know, in the early 90s, leading up to his fight with Pernell Whitaker, where he said that black fighters are cowards and all that type of shit, and they don't like to get hit to the body and all that type of shit. But then his bitch ass went down to a body shot with Bernard Hopkins. And then what pissed me off, you get a lot of these Mexican Oscar De La Hoya supporters that come on your channel saying, oh, well, why are you talking about Oscar and all this shit? Or you're a Floyd Mayweather dick rider. Well, you are Oscar De La Hoya dick rider. And there's a possibility that Oscar rides dick for real based off those pictures. So shut the fuck up. Always trying to play the fucking victim. I feel 7-8 on that. Oscar need to shut the fuck up. This dude get pass after pass for what he done done. And this is what I mean. Motherfuckers love to throw a black man's pass in, in, in his face when it comes to the media. But then they seem to forget when it comes to somebody that ain't black. Yeah, I said it. For real. Oscar need to be quiet, man. He ain't in no position to talk about nobody. All the shit he didn't did. All the shit he continued to do. Just showed a, a video of him last week when he ain't walking around drunk and shit. Got a DUI earlier this year and shit. But this dude constantly, this dude trying to show Floyd Mayweather in handcuffs. Let me tell you something. Floyd could bury Oscar if he really unleashed Oscar's uh, pass to the public. Floyd didn't have mercy on Oscar. I don't know why Floyd just don't go all in on Oscar. Floyd could bury Oscar. Once if Floyd started talking about those emails, Oscar would be finished. So that's what I don't understand why Oscar keep talking shit about Floyd when he know Floyd could bury his ass. Like I say, Golden Boy is barely at float. But this dude sit up here constantly talking about Floyd. This dude is so fucking jealous of Floyd till it ain't even funny, man. The shit just don't make no sense. It, it, I, I mean, he is insanely jealous of Floyd Mayweather, and that's what it come down to. Like I said, this motherfucker ain't got no, no no business talking about nobody. He need to shut the fuck up. Him and Manny Pacquiao. Both of these dudes got, got shady past. But then they, these motherfuckers are always trying to talk about somebody else. Like I said, oh, man, when you always talking talk Oscar out? What you care so much? What you did? Man, shut the fuck up, man. Y'all motherfuckers shut up, man. And stay in y'all motherfucking envelope. Don't start none. It won't be none, man. Stop trying to play revic the, the, the victim shit. And, and, and stop trying to use reverse psychology. You guys not smart enough. Not even close. It's not even in the fucking ballpark. Matter of fact, you don't even have a ticket. You know what I'm saying? So, stop it. But yeah, let's get this going, man. Let's push for uh, Floyd Oscar, too. I'm sure Showtime will pick up the fight. You know what I'm saying?
Like, like, like I said, but Oscar won't do it. If I was Floyd, I would officially challenge Oscar to a rematch. You know what I'm saying? Oscar training, so he says. Floyd, stay training. So, let's do it. 51st fight for Floyd. You know what I'm saying? He gonna clean Oscar's clock. You know, it, it'll be a good fight until Floyd wins. Then they'll say, oh, well, Floyd took it. Vent and it went, hey, you know what I'm saying? Oscar got so much to say. Like I said, why not settle it in the ring, man? Make it happen, man. I'm out.